Welcome back. One final point before we go tonight. Can you believe the gall of Broward County Sheriff Scott Israel to go on CNN on Wednesday night and chastise NRA spokeswoman Dana Lash? Tell her he knows how to keep people safe when he knew his deputy didn't enter the school to stop the shooter. He knew his deputies didn't properly respond to calls about Nicholas Cruz's violence prior to Cruz's attack. What did the sheriff think? That we the people wouldn't find out the truth? See, that's the difference between a conservative and a liberal. Liberals think people are too dumb to find out the truth. Liberals think if they lie to us, we'll just believe them like a bunch of dumb sheep. Conservatives, on the other hand, have faith in individuals who deserve that faith. We trust, but we verify. Unlike our institutions, if government institutions can't stop a shooter after he threatens to kill his fellow students, after he says he's going to be a school shooter, after the FBI is warned by his family that he's a danger to himself and others and is planning to commit a school shooting, after a YouTube channel reported him to the FBI for saying he wanted to be a school shooter, after he's reported to the sheriff for violence 23 times, if our government institutions can't stop a shooter after all those red flags, and yes, felony threats that should prohibit such a psycho from possessing a firearm, don't come near my right to defend myself from madmen like that. It's like this. Broward County Sheriff on TV, gun control is the answer, he says. I know how to keep people safe. But in a press conference the very next day, my deputy, he says, didn't go inside the school during the shooting for two minutes. He cowered outside the school as the shooter fired his shots inside, costing 14 students and three administrators their lives. But yeah, Sheriff, let's trust only the government to keep us safe. Now the Broward County Sheriff has assigned six deputies to guard the house of the school resource officer to keep that deputy safe. Are you understanding this insanity? The Broward County Sheriff can put six deputies to guard the school, to guard the house of the cowardly school resource officer who didn't go into the building to stop the shooting, but they can't guard kids at school? Trust the government to keep you safe, they say. But don't be too hard on the school security guard. You can't expect him to confront a mass shooter. That's unreasonable. You can't have it both ways. Government institutions failed us. We have to rely on ourselves for self-defense and to keep our kids safe. But liberals want us to give all of our guns to the government institutions who failed to keep us safe in the first place? Do you see the problem? And that's my final point. You can reach me on Twitter at Liz underscore Wheeler. If you liked the show, please send me an email at OANN.com slash contact. In the meantime, catch us here tomorrow at 9 p.m. Eastern. And until then, have a good night.